Yulan Chu and welcome to another exciting day in our galaxy and welcome to another shipskin video and today it's my personal favorite and that is the original series Bird of Prey skin for the Augur. I absolutely love this from the original series and uh, I already have that one definitely. But before I get into more details, I just want to say if you're not a subscriber to my channel yet, but do like my videos, then please do subscribe to my channel. And if you do that, then please also click this little bell and all notifications so you will be notified when a new video comes out. And I usually pin a comment uh, as soon as the video is published or as soon as I can after the video is published under this video because there's also information on how to access my Discord server for this channel where I have a lot of information in the database already, which is growing, of course, over time, but it needs a lot of work. And uh, there's Quarks, there's a video library with the videos, and uh, there's a section with polls. So have a look if you want to. And uh, now let's talk about this really nice shipskin. As I said, it's the original series Bird of Prey, the Romulan one, of course. You will remember the episode with the actor that later played Sarek, so Spock's father, as the Romulan commander of, of this Bird of Prey. And um, I really like that episode and I really like that skin. It is, of course, as you can see, only for the Augur, so you cannot apply it to anything else. And of course, you can only apply it when the Augur is in your dock. But this rare skin comes with a bonus. And the bonus is a permanent buff, as usual with the ship skins. Once unlocked, buffs obtained from the ship refits will always be active, even when the refit is not applied. That means if you put it on or not, it will be active and you will get this bonus. And the bonus is a plus of 70% to weapon damage of the Augur against hostiles. So it also helped me in my um, hostile grinding for reputation when I brought the Romulans then to um, the 1 billion lock where I did the second triple lock then. And so of course I needed to grind hostiles for, for the Romulans as well. And uh, that's what I used the Augur for with the ship skin because it made it easier. And I really like the look of it. It's not only there for um, the Augur, by the way. You can later also have it for the Tribune. Um, so for people that like it as much as me, so if you later get the Tribune, you also have a chance to get that ship skin again because it also looks nice in a battle line in territory defense or something and you see that i'm a, a friend of uh, ship skins when i can get them getting them is is the topic here and for this we have to go to the amalgam refinery because that is the point where you can get it you need 80 um, shards for it as a rare one and you can get them here for those shipskin shard trackers you get from the recruit section, you know, the one with Honor Guard Wharf. And then you can exchange them here in the Amalgam Refinery. Uh, one chest for, for this skin costs 90 of those shard trackers. Um, and uh, you can do one, five, or 20 at a time. Um, 20 is 1800 then. What I don't understand though is why it's still here. Scopely can, uh, should really work on that, that stuff that you have already um, could disappear so you have a better overview of what you have and what you don't have. Because by mistake, I'm, I could spend a lot of those shard trackers which are hard to get here on this ship skin, which I don't want because I have it. And then it would be a complete waste because 1800 are not that easy to get with at least with my luck in, in the in the recruit section for them. And so um, I see no sense to to keeping it here um, with with the uh, uh, projectiles. I understand because you get some additional stuff with them because the the refractive beam I got via events already. But there's a second um, 
some torpedo st stuff that is, is uh, included in this package, which was not in the event package. And so I needed to get more ref ref refractive beam projectiles here to get the, these torpedoes as well. But um, it, it's not with the ship skins. You don't get anything else with it. So I don't know why they left it in here, um, although I have it. In other places, in event stores, for example, if you have a ship, it's it's gone from the event store. This Argo refit, as soon as I got it, it was gone from the event store. and um, Or the refractive beam refit was gone from the event store. But in the amalgam refinery, it's still there. So um, there are some details Scopely could could uh, do some adjustments. I mean, they have to do some bigger adjustments in the game still. But uh, like with the NX-01, where uh, I'm still waiting for an answer from support uh, because of the problem with the um, with those improved um, aquatic hostiles in in the token systems there is some issue at the moment that wasn't there when when i had a brand new nx01 i could kill uh, those and uh, nowadays i can't anymore because the super weapon that shouldn't hit the nx01 because the super weapon has nine shots the nx01 is deflecting nine shots but still in the first fight I'm getting killed by one of those nine shots and uh, there I'm still waiting for an answer from support but I wasted a lot of tokens already so they are not that fast there at the moment again and so small things like the algo refit still in the amalgam refinery is probably not one of the biggest problems they have at the moment that's what I wanted to say but if you want to tell me about your opinion of this refit if do you like it as much as I do um, then uh, please write it in the comments. If you have it, let me know what you think about it. If you are targeting it to get it as well, let me know. And if you otherwise have questions or video requests, you know that I'm regularly reading the comments, so please write it as well. And if you just want to say hi and what city, for example, you're from, I'm always curious where my active viewers are coming from. And if you want to see another video right now, the next one is right here in the end screen. I'll see you there. I'll be back.